In a KWA News investigation, several people in northwest Arkansas say they're out hundreds of dollars each after a local furniture store cut off all communication with its customers. Thank you for joining us. I'm Nate Custer. Jennifer Pinate is off tonight. KWA's Kelly O'Neill in Springdale to show us how customers are responding after realizing the company that took their money might have gone out of business. If I have a receipt and I don't have a recliner. They guaranteed us 8 to 12 weeks delivery. We're well past that. I've emailed them twice. We've tried to call them like at least three or four times. The Springdale Police Department says multiple reports have been filed and an investigation is underway against Mason's Home Furnishings. The store hours on the side of this building say this place is open at 10 a.m., but the doors are locked. I paid cash. Zach Nixon says he bought a sectional and a recliner from the store back in September and is still waiting for the chair. I reached out to the guy that actually sold it to me and he says he does, no longer works for that business and I came up here and I reached out every week. I mean every couple of days me and my wife was calling and asking because we knew something was going on after a month. Brock Green and Haley Martin who didn't want to go on camera have a similar story. They're out of $680 after order and two recliners in September that have never been delivered. Nobody's answered the phone, and so we can't get in touch with anybody at the store, and we're out of the cash. We tried calling the business's phone number listed online, but hit a dead end. Memory is full. Enter the remote access code. According to the Secretary of State's office, Mason's Home Furnishings LLC is owned by Michaela Mason of Springdale. After contacting her numerous times via social media, still no response. We looked for the company's Facebook page and website, but both are deleted, and Michaela Mason's personal Twitter is now gone as well. The email address once posted on the door is now undeliverable. We even knocked on her door, but no answer. You would think somebody that owns a business would at least want to, you know, try to make it right. We contacted the Arkansas Better Business Bureau, which has also been unable to reach the owner of Mason's. It appears that the business is not operating at the current time. The Springdale City Clerk's Office says it's received five to six complaints from consumers so far. Those who are still waiting say they just want others to be aware. We just want it to be fair and we feel like the situation wasn't fair. We don't want other people to be in the same boat. In Springdale, Kelly O'Neill, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News. Thank you, Kelly. If you purchase furniture from Mason's Home Furnishings in Springdale and have not received it, call the Attorney General's Office or Springdale Police Department Detective Freddie Vieta. You can find that contact information on our website at nwahomepage.com.